Today we're going to be unboxing the Barbie Fast Cast Clinic. This is part of the Barbie You Can Be Anything line and of course, you can. Anything you put your mind to, you can do. So this is a really fun set because we actually have some Play-Doh that we can use to build some casts and to do some really fun stuff. So there's gonna be 30 plus pieces inside here from crutches to casts to the Play-Doh, all kinds of stuff. And as part of the You Can Be Anything series, there are going to be 200 plus careers to look out for. So keep an eye out for any of the Barbie You Can Be Anything line. That is super fun. So we can take a look at the back. This is the doll that comes with it. Our patient is not included, but there's all kinds of different fun things that you can do with this. So let's go ahead and get into it. All right, so I opened up the box, it's not pretty. I'm gonna go ahead and get all the pesky pieces and plastic bits out, and then we'll take a look at everything once I snip all of this stuff off. All right, so I've got everything out of the box. There is a million little plastic pieces, so let's take a look at everything we have. I'm gonna move all the small accessories off to the side, and I wanna take a look at Dr. Barbie first. Let me go ahead and move my stand up just a little bit so we can get a full view of her face. So of course she comes with this mint green stethoscope. She has her chart in her hand, and I left the plastic piece on that so it stays a little bit easier. She of course has her white doctor's coat and pretty spring colored dress underneath and mint green looks like loafers or crocs or some kind of slide her knees are going to bend and she is going to not unfortunately have bendable arms you would think that with the bending knees you'd have bending arms but we do not she has beautiful brown hair and brown eyes and a pleasant smile which of course is what you want when you go to the doctor you want a doctor that's going to be kind and calm with you so putting her off to the side let's take a look at some of our accessories we have a Barbie balloon. We have this little basket that we can put on our bedside over there and we have pink flowers. We have some candy. I don't know if this is supposed to be an M&M type of candy or maybe a Skittles type of candy. We have our get well card. Cute little purple teddy bear. We have a sheet of stickers with lots of band-aids on them. We've got this piece here. We have three colors of Play-Doh. We have white, pink, and purple. We have our x-rays of our foot and ankle, of our leg and knee. We have a third x-ray over here of our hand. Of course, if you're at the doctor and you need x-rays, chances are you broke or sprained something. So we have some silver crutches, pink water bottle, blue water bottle. We have a mask for our doctor. We have a cast saw. And then we have our cast molds. So this is where we can implement the Play-Doh. So this is a larger mold. This is actually specifically, if you can see on the inside, for the bottom of the leg, the ankle and leg area. This is a smaller mold for the hand and arm. I guess I would say forearm on that. And then this, the smallest mold, is specifically for your wrist and hand. So moving all of that over, let's take a look at some of our pieces. So we have our sink. This door is going to open. That tray is going to come out. We actually can use this piece. That's gonna be how we use our Play-Doh here. And we've got our pain scale from zero to 10. We've got a hook up here so we can hang our masks and any of the accessories that we might need to hang, get out of the way if we're not using them. That one doesn't wanna stay there. No, we won't hang that one. And the back is plain. Next up, we have our x-ray machine, and that's where we are going to be able to slide in our different x-rays and take a look at what is injured on our dolls. It's a cool machine. It actually does look like a little x-ray on it. 
All right. And we have our um, little gift shop that they have at the bottom downstairs, usually of all the hospitals with flowers and stuffed animals, water, and some goodies. And this is actually going to be double-sided. We've got magazines, fruit, and flowers on the back as well. And that's where we would probably find the majority of the stuff that came in the basket, of course, are flowers, which we might actually be able to, let's see, does that stick in here? No, but that might hang off the side. Might be able to hang that off the side there. No, that doesn't want to do that either. Okay, well, we can put that in the basket. We have our little teddy bear we can put here. Our candy we can display. And then of course we've got our water bottles as well. It's a perfect spot for this stuff. And naturally you need your card, so we'll put that in the back as well. Maybe that's for this. Is that for this? Yep. That looks like that would make sense. Put that in there. Except you have to snap that in the right way. And there we go. Okay. Last up, we have our bed. Looks like I missed a little piece of tape. So this is gonna be our patient bed. It is going to adjust. We can have it straight up, reclining a little, or flat down so our doll can do the examinations. So let's take a look at this Play-Doh. Let's do a fun color like pink. And since we don't have a patient, Dr. Barbie is going to be our patient for demonstration purposes. So you are going to go ahead and open up the Play-Doh. All right, I found a blanket that I dropped too, so we also have a cozy blanket. So we're gonna go ahead, finishing up our Play-Doh. Got that open. I'm sorry, Barbie dough. Not to be confused with name brand Play-Doh, it is Barbie dough. So. We're going to open up our dough, break off a little bit, don't want to go too much. We're going to go ahead and say that Dr. Barbie hurt her leg. So I'm going to fill the cast here. Like I said, I feel like a little goes a long way with this, so I'm going to not go crazy with it. I'm going to drop that stand down a little bit. I think that's probably where this comes in. By the way, guys, there's no instructions on this. There is a scan, like a barcode thing that you can scan um, for a demonstration, but can't really do that while filming. So I'm winging it. And if you notice that I've done something wrong, let me know in the comments. Okay, so I filled each side of the cast with Play-Doh. We are going to go ahead and put the cast on Barbie's leg. Give it a good squeeze there. See some Play-Doh dripping out the side. Probably don't need that. You can take the excess Play-Doh off the top. Kind of clean it up a little bit. And then we release. And ta-da. And they will bring her in close. Now Barbie has a cast. We would send her out of the doctor's office, of course, using some crutches. And that's how the Play-Doh Fast Clinic works. When you're done, obviously it's Play-Doh, so you just pull it on off. You can pretend to use your cast cutter. And you can use all different kinds of color combinations. Again, this comes with Barbie dough, but you can use obviously Play-Doh or any other kind of dough product like that. Um, and then you've got all the different colors. You can use the pink, the purple, the white, mix and match your own. This is a lot of fun. So this is the Barbie Fast Clinic. 
that's going to do it for me today, guys. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to check out our Instagram page for exclusive photos of all of our unboxing news, updates, and so much more. We have a lot of fun stuff coming up for you. So don't forget to hit that red subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, and or share this video with your friends. We will go ahead and drop the Amazon affiliate link below if you're interested in purchasing the Barbie Fast Clinic. And if you are interested in purchasing your Dashing Diva nails like I wear exclusively, we'll drop that link below as well, as well as our Patreon link where we have exclusive content for our members. So if you're interested in that, make sure you check that out as well. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.